here. Um, I am sitting on a toilet in my bathroom. <laughs> Classy, huh? I just wanted to make a video about uh, some of the stuff that I've been doing lately and stuff that I want to do. Um, I'm tired now. <laughs> I had to set the table up and put the stuff on the table. So, yeah. Um, but I've been working on this shirt and I'm like really, really happy and excited about it. Uh, it needs a trim all around the unicorn. Um, but I just love it. Like, working on this project is so much fun and it makes me really, really happy and um, I'll be really excited to pass it on to somebody who loves it as much as I do. But, uh, doesn't look like I'll be working on that today. I got up and, um, I woke up at like 2. And I visited with my kitties a little bit and I had my, um, green drink and I was like feeling really good, you know, like really carpe diem and I wanted to see if I could put makeup on because sometimes I can when I feel like I can and sometimes I can't and um, it took a couple tries, it took two tries uh, on this eye and then this eye like I just did it better. Um, probably because I actually did my left eye with my left hand, and I probably did it on my right eye with my right hand, or with my left hand also, because it shakes less, but I just didn't think of that, you know, you're right-handed all your life, you use your right hand on the right side of your face. Um, but I'm really happy with how my makeup turned out, and it's really minimal, I just have mascara, eyeliner, and then, um, I shaded in just the front part of my brow, um, with pink, and then, like, the highlight underneath. I don't even know if you can, like, see that. I'm, like, sitting in the bathroom because there's good lighting and I don't have to have the window open for sun lighting, which makes it hotter, but that's why I'm here. I think I'm going to sneeze. I might still sneeze. I don't know. Okay, so... go get this shirt, which is really exciting because it was downstairs, and, um, I was just, I just was like, I'm just gonna go get my shirt, <laughs> and, uh, I could hear that there was vacuuming going on, I didn't know if, you know, uh, Sean's mom was downstairs, like, getting things cleaned up, and I was like, well, I don't want that to be in her way, and I don't really need it down there, like, it's definitely been 72 hours, so the, the fabric glue is like toast cured and um I just like went down there and I was singing the pirates that don't do anything the veggie tales song because it's just been in my head today just like we're the pirates who don't do anything and um I just like went down the stairs like really easy and you know um with like a spring in my step and I got my shirt and I saw Stacy, but I didn't say anything to him because I don't really want to invite him into my reality. He's an icky energy. But he's the one that's vacuuming today. So that's like, craze. And, uh, and then I, like, bebop back up the stairs, like, with the spring in my step and, you know, like, one foot on each step as I go. Just, it was just awesome. Like, I, <laughs> if you take steps, like, every day of your life and, and you walk around with ease, like, you just, like, cannot possibly understand, like, how liberating and how wonderful it is to like do that when it's not the norm um it just is like so victory and um I say I got dressed today I put on like little black shorts and I I slept in this in my top so I didn't really like get dressed but I did my makeup so I feel like that's getting dressed and this is, like, absolutely what my hair looked like when I woke up. I think it looks fine, so what else? And, okay, so I was feeling, like, really, really good. And I was like, oh, I should totally, like, start doing my um, project. I wanted to do this My Little Pony project because I've been gathering these blind bag ponies when I go out. And um, these are the My Little Pony Friendship is Magic blind bags. They have a single figure in them, and there's a card. 
Um, I should have gotten one of mine out to show you, like, uh, what's inside. But it's just a, it's a small pony, and, um, this is the first series. We only have the first series in America right now, um, so that's all I can get, but I get these at Toys R Us, and I have seven of them, and what I want to do which I thought I'd like be starting today, is um, make a video like opening the blind bag on the camera and um, seeing what pony I got and then like creating an outfit that's inspired by that pony. So um, I really wanted to do that today. I'm like kind of upset that I can't, but I'm making this video and that's really cool. Um, yeah, so, okay. Uh, I will be doing this eventually. Um, hopefully really soon. <sighs> but, um, I've got seven blind bags, and I want to do, like, a week of outfits. Um, but I don't think it'll be, like, seven days in a row. I think I'll just, like, put them in a row, like put the videos in a row or in a series or something. Um, okay, yeah, so um, I hope you like tune in and look forward to me doing that because I really want to do it. I like really need your help and love and anticipation for this project of mine. Um, I have a really fun wardrobe, uh, as you may or may not know, and I just am like really excited to see who's in there and like what outfits I can put together to correspond with the pony. Um, so blind bags are like so fun, you know, like you don't know what's in there and I love things that are like truly a surprise. So I just like freaked when I saw that there were uh, Little Mermaid squinkies and then like in this um, little bin like under where they're hanging the squinkies uh, are, uh, is a box and it's like, it's a, it's a lot of different Disney ones, but like, this is the first Little Mermaid one that I grabbed, and I was like, oh my god, I, I hope, I hope, I hope, like, I totally knew what I wanted in there. And, oh my god, what, what is, it's in there, it's in there. So I opened it, and I don't know if you can tell, but I opened it like all fancy, I used the scissors and did like a wave, because it's, you know, Little Mermaid. Which, if you don't know, like, there are a few things that I love more than The Little Mermaid. Um, it's, like, my favorite Disney movie. Um, and I think it has to come first because it came first in my life. But, like, I absolutely love Aladdin and The Emperor's New Groove also. Like, oh my god, so much. Like, I seriously, like, I watch The Little Mermaid and Aladdin, like, several times a week. Like, all the time. And, um, Emperor's New Groove is, like, my feel-good movie, like, when I'm sick. I totally watched that, and, um, yeah, it just makes me feel so, so much better, so, I don't know if you can see, like, they show, like, these, like, the main characters you get in, like, a pack, like, you get a pack of them, and they're not, like, hidden, you know exactly what you're getting, so, Ariel and Sebastian and Flounder, um, and Eric, like, they were, I can see what they look like. So I was just like really excited when I opened this. Oh, it's totally Ursula. Ah! I was so excited. Oh my God, I'm so excited now. Like I feel like I just opened it. I haven't actually like opened them yet and look at them. They have like a little piece of plastic around the ball which I'm trying to move, and I really don't care if I break the ball. In the process of getting the plastic out. <sighs> Alright. You can see, like, the ball is glittery. It's, like, glittery. And you can see through it. It's not, like, as blind as it could be. But, oh my god, look at 
little, let me hold that with my other hand for you. Look at little Ursula. I really, like, appreciate Squinkies. They're so cute, and, like, they have Minnie Mouse ones and Barbie ones, and they're really adorable. Um, the boy series, they have, like, Marvel, and I think it would be really cool to have Monster High ones, but this is just, like, so cool. Uh, I've gotten Squinkies before, and I have, like, a jewel container that I keep my pills in, but I got those for my cat Grin because he loves to play with Squinkies. Like, loves them. It's so well done. She's so well done. And then this other one, like, I so love this one because it's, um, I showed it to my boyfriend. He didn't, he was like, what is that thing? And it's like, oh, you just don't know anything. <laughs> but that's not true. He's just not, like, completely obsessed with the Little Mermaid like I am, so. Okay. Do you know what it is? Do you know what it is? Okay, so when she's like sitting on the rock and Sebastian's starting to sing the song Under the Sea, she like just like runs her fingers over this little like pink tuft sticking out of the out of the surface and they all like and all of these little things just like come up and they're like oh all around her and it's just so magical and it's just one of my favorite moments and I just like love Every, every image of her on that rock, like, just, like, pause it, and it's just to die for. I just love it. So, like, the greatest, aren't they? They are so great. I love them. I don't know what I'm going to do with them. <laughs> but they are, like, totes adorbs. Isn't that an adorable word? It makes me think of, like, absorb and adorable. Like, I want to absorb it. It's so adorable. But my boyfriend came up with that. He, like, said it one night and was like, huh. <laughs> I just said adorb. And I was like, yes, you did. It's a great word. So, look, I set them on the little things they came in. I don't know if you can see that. Can you see it? I hope you can. But they're Disney Princess um, Squinkies, and seriously, I have never seen a cuter Ursula in my entire life. And I don't even know what these little guys are called, but I just, they're like little seahorses, and they've got like Muppet Moppy hair type tufts on their head, and I love them, so it's really fun to, to open blind bags and like really get like what you absolutely like, opulent, like the best thing you could have imagined in there, like, was a tiny Ursula for me, so, yeah. Life's full of great things. Um, there is a pi price to pay for going down the stairs for me today, and that's okay, because I really, really loved doing it, and I wouldn't, like, take it back for anything, like, walking down the stairs and back up, like, easily was just such an amazing experience and I wish I could do that every day. In fact, I thought about turning around and just like doing it again for no reason, <laughs> but I didn't do that. Um, it has like really worn me out and making this video has really worn me out. Um, but hopefully I'll get some rest and like feel well enough to do some delishing it up today because I really feel like so creative and just like I just want to make stuff today so bad so hopefully I get to do that and hopefully you all are creating a beautiful day for yourselves and for everyone else that you meet today and remember that the whole universe is just full of love so if you ever feel like you're unhappy or like things are really sucky then just like remember that everything is there for the purpose of love and uh, even if you don't know the reason for it like it's okay because the universe loves you and I love you so love and light no natural light today um okay well thank you for watching and definitely Stay tuned for my seven days of blind bag pony outfit inspirations and the finishing of my fairy cake uni shirt. It's unilicious.